Hello and welcome back to Kino Plays Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Let's go. Um, I think it's... is it this door or is it the other door? This one. Totally missed that jump. <laughs> By the way, Sekiro, it sounds like your battle to sever immortality with Kuro is near a conclusion. You killed all those who interfered? I did. I see. You did well to kill without hesitation. Yeah, have some booze, dude. Yeah. Well, well, if this isn't Dragon Spring, you done really, oh, you've really done it this time, Sekiro. Ah, that hit the spot. Whenever I used to get my hands on Dragon Spring, a bunch of fools would start coming to me, demanding drinks. <laughs> fools? Fools who wouldn't let go of their cross spears while they drank. Fools who would steal sake using illusion techniques. Fools tinkering with half-finished prosthetics, sake cup in hand. And even the cunning owl, who despite his size would turn bright red after the first drop. That's... yes, your father was a fool too. To the fools! Yes. Okay, that's cool. Don't forget, Sekiro, hesitate and you lose. That is the way of war. Eh. That it? I can't talk to you anymore? Eh. Well, got a little bit more of the story out, finding out that Ishin dr would have drinks with um, the near the Doctor, the sculptor, and your dad. Cool. Right. This seems to be the right one. Now to try and not fall straight off the tree this time. That was way too late. Ah, damn it. Gotta get the timing down right. Which clearly isn't that. Ah, damn it. There's such a long wind-up be before that attack. Of course, apparently I can just attack him in up close and personal, so never mind. <laughs> oh, you trolling dick. <laughs> I really thought I was going to have to use the lightning counter against that guy. <laughs> apparently not. Well, there's still more of this part to explore before I need to go into the water. Shit! Um, can I get back up from down here? I saw a grapple point, but still. What the hell? No, there's an item up there that wasn't there before. 
You're trolling shit heel. <laughs> and another sculptor's idol. Okay, I think I saw a hook shot point as I was swimming along here. Ah, I'm too far away, I can't use that one. Ah, so it was just a little bit lower on a different branch. Alright, um... Hopefully this will actually work, in, but in ten, send me to the one that I just came from, not the one I used to teleport. Which is it going to be? Ah, good. Ah, still not the last gourd seed. I want to max my flask, come on. That was a mistake. Full of fuck-ups. <laughs> like that's unexpected. Well, since I've messed it up so much, let's deal with the Shichiman Warrior. Or at least try to. Now, just remember, there's a wolf up there I need to deal with. Oh crap, he's already seen me! You know what, I'm going to grab that item first, just in case. Yeah, not what I thought it would be. doing that aerial jump. clear up some of these things so I don't get caught by them.
Okay, I don't think this is going as well as the last time I fought one of these guys. Do your beam attack. So I shall use this first and then healed. Now where is he? Oh shit! Still got me revived back. Crap, 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 
Okay, okay. Not what I wanted to do there. Watering it up with these spirits. Okay. No. What the hell? Stupid thing. Oh, you little dick! There we go. Huh, ah, wipe it largely. Okay. Precious Azure Lodge Light, used for the highest level of prosthetic tool upgrades. Fountainhead Lodge Light is a symbol of eternity, and anything forged with it will never break nor rust thanks to the blessing of the Divine Dragon. Tools forged with Lodge Light transcend human intellect and are dubbed as treasures of the Divine Dragon. Interesting. Holy crap! Those guys are always a pain to fight. <laughs> Even with basically cheesing them with the shield. How do I get across to that one? Do I have to go from higher up? Don't really want to fight and go that way. Um, I should just teleport. Well, he looks bigger than the others. Making me go the long way. Yeah. <laughs> and me and did I miss the turn? Where's, where's the way that goes even higher? Oh, here it is. <laughs> I wasn't even close to where I thought I was. Can I hook shot from up here over to there? That's the question. Probably from above. No, I think that's just water. Um, not seeing anywhere I can hook shot. So that was a no. Oh. Oh, 
chance. In that case, how do I get across here? Maybe this is somewhere you return from? Try from down here, see if there's any hook shots. Otherwise, it'll be time to start swimming. Yep, it's swimmy time. What just saw me? Hmm, more bait. Respawn. Give me another chance to kill you. Okay, that's one. How many did I say I needed? Seven more? Oh boy, um, that's a big boy. Maybe I shouldn't be in the water. Oh, wait, are you the same one I talked to before? Did you teleport? Young man. Do you happen to be going to the palace? Yes. If you are, you should take the back path. Nowadays it's underwater, but there is a large cave you can take to get there. Only, I hear the great carp now sleeps there. Okay. Why are you helping me? The gates to the palace have been closed for a long time now. I have a very important task I must tend to, but I couldn't possibly do it with this body of mine. Might you open the door to the palace, young man? Yeah, same bit. Okay. Hmm. Ah, there's the bell. Because I need. I don't know how to get up there. I know that I need to get there to kill the carp. I mean. Maybe you can fight it? I don't know, but I know that there's a kind of a puzzle thing where you ring that bell and you feed it the bait I've been collecting. Though I think there might be another type of bait as well that I need to get f for it. I don't think it's just the one type. But how do I get up there? Because I haven't seen any way to get over. Maybe there's an underwater way. Oh, first I saw some items inside this building, didn't I? Well, an item. More grave wax. This is a big place.
no hook shot points here. Maybe I just have to try and swim past the carp. Bait. That's a big dead fish. Oh, and there's a headless down here. Wonderful. That's just what I needed. In fact... There's two of these sons of bitches. Awesome. And I have no healing items because I used them all and then forgot. Oh, that's a good sign. Rebeed. Get me the fuck out of there. So where in the hell am I supposed to go at the moment? Good amount of range, I think. Oh, treasure cut. Oh, there's one. Come here. Damn it. Got away. For now. Alright, asshole. Respawn. <laughs> Son of a bitch! 
<laughs> oh, now you're just trolling me. to sneak up on them, or at least just be closer to where they spawn from. This is getting a little annoying. <laughs> I wonder. Okay, from the surface, can I at least use sugar? No, I can't. These guys are absolute assholes. Yes! Yes! Got you! Alright, how many is that so far? Ten. I need two more. Well, two more to complete the mask. I don't know how many overall. Ah, it didn't lock on. Idiot. Is exactly what I am. A complete idiot. Alright, come back while I'm hiding. <laughs> is probably the best place to hide for this one. Come on, respawn. Maybe I'm too close to... What? Damn it. <laughs> yeah, maybe I was too close to where it spawned in for that to do it until I started swimming away. Okay, now I can complete that mask. Oh, yeah, that's right, I needed I needed 12 more than that for the other two lapis lazuli, didn't I? That's what, it was, what I wanted the rest of them for. Nice. Well, that instantly drops me down to only needing nine more. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I was wondering where you were hiding, dude, because I hadn't seen you in a while. Okay, so that's where I need to go from. So where is that from the surface? Okay, so it's this section with lots of tree brushes around it. I mean, this area is still really big, so maybe there's other stuff that will be useful to me. Plus, I should probably rest and get me health back. I think 
I went in that building. Yeah, I did go in that building. Okay, so we've got two more treasure carps here. I thought there'd have been an item hidden inside that building then. That's it, come closer. Oh shit! <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I keynote that up. Good thing it's unlimited breathing underwater. Oh, I'm not. Uh, I'm not where I thought I was. I thought I was right by that other bridge. lump. Seems like a strange place for one of those. Let's go explore the corpse tunnel then. Hmm. Or should I try the headless? Yeah, I should probably try the headless. Oh, there's an item there. for pissed off fish. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Hopefully I'll have enough time to swim down there once I do this. That's seriously bad. Oh, that's really bad. Swim away, swim away, swim away.
Oh! Okay, so... The confetti helped. But... Got a bit too close to him. I have, to, I have to worry about that other one first. And I should probably pop a um, pacifying agent before I go down as well. Alright, pacifying agent, then confetti, then swim like hell down there to attack him. Maybe an ongo sugar as well. Right, so. Agent. Confetti. Sugar. Totally missed with that. Uh, I can't use the confetti all underwater, can I? No. And I've got a feeling that if I try and run away to get ready for it, he'll regenerate his health. So this is all about the hit and run away technique. Of course, once I've killed one, that'll make the other one much easier to fight. Yashiriku's Spiritfall. Falling headless spirit of Yashiriku. Briefly, sac briefly sacrifice max vitality and posture while gaining a large attack power boost. Consume spirit emblems to use repeatedly. Nice! Headless are the rune form of corrupted heroes who once fought for their country. This brave soul's twin was lost in utero. He may not have fallen to the palace nobles had his sibling been at his side. Wait, did they both disappear? Huh. Okay. So I only needed to kill one of them. That's even better than I thought. Sweet. So that's both of... So that's the two underwater headless fights complete. I've just got the three above ground ones to do. In order to get all of these to replace the sugars. Nice. Yeah, I did explore this one, didn't I? Yeah. And now that I've got a little bit more time, 
make sure I didn't miss anything down here. Okay, so there's a bunch of giant carp dead down here. And creepy ass worms. Well, they look. No, caterpillars instead of worms. Weird. I wonder what that's about. I mean, they're not the same sort of things that infest things as we used to see. I'm just gonna get insta-killed because you're not supposed to go in here straight away. Hmm. Okay, I'd say you're supposed to use stealth, judging by this. Big, and he's got a grandpa face. Oh, I got items down there, but I can try for items after I've killed him. Okay, so that's not the way to sneak around him then. Big bad boom. So let's check behind the waterfall first. <sighs> All the gamer instincts say check behind waterfalls. This game, screw you, nothing behind waterfalls. So I'll actually rest here and recover my stuff. Right. Okay. Nice. Okay, they've gone feral. But I'm guessing they'll still do terror attacks, so...
Shortcut unlocked. Still hasn't joined me over to there though. Yay! Finally! I think I might have missed something. I mean, this seems to be taking me further and further away from where I want, where I want to be. How do I get over there? Did not give you any room to recover. I can hear something breathing. I mean, I know there are those enemies directly underneath me. if there's somewhere else. Doesn't look like there's a way into there. Maybe there's an alternate route while I'm swimming. Maybe I can change direction and that'll get me into there. Oh, well, when we find out. And that's not the way. <laughs> Actually, seeing as though I've just done that for it, let's see if she has anything else to say. Oh, there's an item over there. Weird. I wonder how I missed that. Yeah, let's. Maybe she has something to say to me now that I've opened the palace gate for it. Nope. Nothing changed. Maybe I need to actually rest for it to change. Grave wax. I think I saw. Yep, saw an item inside this building. Okay, 
from the other side. Yummy scrap. Missed me turn. Well, let's see. Let's just go the long, go the more dangerous looking route. Well, it certainly doesn't look like there's any extra, p any hidden passages. I guess I'll just have to try carrying on forwards then. And hope it reconnects. Got some ledge like let's see if I can get any new upgrades. I, mean, I think I need fulminated mercury for any of the upgrades that I do want, but I don't well, it's worth checking. Still haven't seen any fulminated mercury. It's, it seems weird considering I found lazulite already. Yeah, I haven't even unlocked the last route. Oh, and even the cheapest ones need two. Okay. Yeah, I need Fulminated Mercury, Fulminated Mercury, Fulminated Mercury, and... Oh yeah, Fulminated Mercury. <laughs> God damn it. And at least I got some got a decent amount of grave wax. Um, oh yeah, I got enough for the um, mask, didn't I? So let's buy that while we're here. Nice. Okay. Oh, I only need one more for the next leisurely. Nice. Dancing Dragon Mask. A dragon's head dancing mask made whole by piecing the fragments back together grants the ability to exchange skill points for attack power in the sculptor's idle menu. The Okami warrior women would wear this to the Fountainhead Palace. There they would dance as an offering for the dragon. Mysteriously, the ritual left them bri brimming with vigour. Awesome. That's useful for after you've actually unlocked every skill, which I still have a ways to go on. <laughs> well, we will continue exploring this and finding out whether or not I can kill the giant cop next time on Kino Plays Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. New episodes upload daily to the YouTube channel, 9pm UK time. Thank you for joining me, take care, and goodbye. <laughs>